everything mm-hmm. is energy, right? Um, uh, that at our core, we are energetic beings. That's where it all starts. And so I wanted to not just like hone in on that because we, we know that so well. So many people have read Jerry Tennant's, you know, Healing is Volt, all of that. Sure. I wanted to go directly into the actual device, the immortal chamber, and really let you open up about like what were, what are the different modalities and technologies within it for the audience? And why did you select those? Yeah, totally. So first of all, it wasn't just me. You know, it's a big group of people who all yeah. have had their own unique health journeys. And if I could rewind about Please. 30 seconds, what I would say is there is a little piece of science and this whole energy mysticism that we want to unwind and demystify. Yep. So there's a concept of like the body is energy, right? But what is energy? Well, energy is actually extremely diverse. There are many, 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 many types. And if you study what some people would call the zero point field or the quantum field, the universal field, all terms for the same thing, that is the governing field that governs the rest of physics. There's ions and subatomic particles popping in and out of that all the time. So we have to start to dissect, okay, that's the commonality, but what's the next layer and what runs this matter? And I think this is where a lot of, this is where I, I won't say a lot of folks, but this is where I went astray, right? You study tenant stuff and you're like, okay, it's electricity. If you look at uh, the Ayurvedic, you know, it's all air, right? Mm -hmm. It's actually all of these things. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the piece we want to back up and unwind is the human body is at core and energetic system that essentially holds together the matter. There's enough energy to hold it together. And those energies are different. And those are the different varieties of things that go into the machine. So let's break them down. You do have electromagnetism. That's Mm -hmm. electricity. So we have an analog form of PEMF. You also have, we'll loosely define it as sound or vibration. Mm -hmm. So that is largely held by hollow organs and water. So we have sound. We have the biochemical bucket. So that's everything that's like basically condensed matter. So you actually have to have something that shakes that up. And that's kind of where the vibration comes into play and the, um, the antioxidant effect of like molecular uh, hydrogen. Mm-hmm. And then we have to tap into the body's own natural energies, which is largely sympathetic, getting up, doing things, movement, that's the get up and go, and the parasympathetic, which is the rest, digest, and heal, aka restore. Mm -hmm. We don't necessarily tap into the fifth battery there, the fifth human battery, which is food and diet, because we know that world well. There's millions and millions of supplements. But those are the, the core five things, you know, that go into the human biofield software that runs the hardware. So then we pick those technologies and we apply them. <laughs>